what do we have here? A quick unboxing uh, from my buddy Anthony Roth, who, you know, we trade back and forth knives sometimes. Sometimes I do a little work for him on his knives, like if he needs something modified. Something modified. Uh, we're going to open it up with this here Vosti Gator that's been modified and still maybe has some more mods to go because it's still a little bit too blunt for me. I think I'm laying it back a little bit more. It's funny how you can just, you know, do more work on something. I, I modified this. Now I'm going to modify it again. Maybe I'll modify it ten more times. Who knows? Let's get this thing open. Love the closing sound of this guy. All right, let's see what we got. I swear to God, I don't really remember maybe what it even is. Okay, we've got some separate pieces here. It's interesting. I'm pretty sure we traded something. Um, I don't know what this is. Or maybe I just bought something from me. Okay, it's an interesting thing. It's like a bottle opener uh, with a... I don't know what the heck it is. I'm going to have to ask him what the heck this thing is supposed to be even. Is it a bottle opener? Is it a rail for a rifle? I don't know. I don't know what it is. I've got to find out what that's about. And then this. Let's see what this guy is. Oh, this is a QSP. That's right, the QSP. This is a QSP. It is called a horn bill. QS146. Yeah, it's a hornbill. Um, I actually did some work on the scales for this knife for him, uh, but then he just got tired of it, so I was like, hey man, let me get that hornbill from you if you don't like it anymore. They were, the, uh, the carbon fiber was black with blue bits in it, and I just kept dyeing it and dyeing it. It took like an hour to get the blue to leave it. Oh, that's nice, man. Okay, the lock access could be a little better. I don't know. That's not bad, actually. Yeah, not bad lock access. you got to get used to it. It's got a thumb stud and a, a reverse flick, you know, hole, thumb hole, whatever you want to call it. Oh, that's really nice action. What's the blade steel on this guy? Is it D2? No, it's S35. That's nice. Boy, I really like that. That clip is pretty cool looking. Kind of pointy on the end, but I don't know. I think I like it. Let's see. How's it feel in the pocket? Okay, it's a little tight. Yeah, I would say it's a little tight. But boy, otherwise, nice tall grind. Feels fairly thin. Nothing, you know, super slicey, but pretty thin. I mean, the blade itself isn't super thick either. I mean, compared to that freaking hog. So, you know, I think it's... I think I like it a lot. It's a really nice size, too. It's uh, maybe 3.25, something like that. So, not huge, but, you know... Wow, yeah, I think I like it a lot. Can we call it a harpoon? I don't know. I think it is damn close to a harpoon. I'm going to call it a harpoon, I think. And it's got a couple different angles on the blade. I like that a lot. Closes right down. Hit your thumb there. Doesn't cut you. Oh, it's a front flipper. Good Lord, I didn't even know it was a front flipper until just now. And it's not a bad front flipper. I mean, I've had better ones, but it's not bad. Yeah, you find the right place to do it. Yeah. And it pops pretty good. Thumb opens great. Okay. All right. I think I like it a lot. I might have to reduce that pressure on that uh, pocket clip just a bit, but that's not that difficult, man. You take the pocket clip off. You grind a little bit off of that bottom there until it's not pressing so hard. It's going to actually sit down a little further when I do that, but it won't be quite so hard to get open. And I could actually grind underneath the back side of it till it tilts up a little bit that might be a better way to do it i don't know we'll do something because i really like it i hate to have it be annoying to get in and out of the pocket and it is a tiny bit annoying but that's my only downside to it really good air goes feels really good in the hand the choke up position's great boy that's a really nice knife boy i like it a lot thanks a lot mr anthony roth well, we'll have a you know full review of it later after I carry it some and uh, check it out more and cut things with it. Yeah, frick, let's just cut a piece of paper with it now. It's a user, so I don't expect it to be razor sharp, but well, I'd say it's pretty darn sharp. 
Very nice. I like it. QSP Hornbill. Have a nice day.